Hi, my name is Nicole and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I would like to show you my bathroom. It's going to be a bathroom tour as an extreme minimalist, but I will warn you now, some things have changed since and it's not the most aesthetically pleasing. There's gonna be a few things that are pleasing to the eye. I just have to get on it and I'll just show you what it's like. Reference, it's a council bathroom, so it's not gonna be the best quality. And there's gonna be some mistakes that the workmen are left behind because, well, they like to cut corners as, in as many ways as possible. That being said, let's have a look at it. I'm really embarrassed to be showing you it, but it is what it is. It's real life and I make do with what I've got. Bathroom tour. And I'm going to show you everything I absolutely keep in my bathroom. It's not going to be the best lighting and it's not going to be the best aesthetically pleasing video to film. But it's going to be real life. I live in a one bedroom council flat. The council in England are very well known for not doing their places properly and often leave a little bit of dirt or mistakes wherever they go. I just get given them by friends and family who also buy toothbrushes for Harry. Then we have the products that I use every day and some hand wash that I keep wanting to experiment living without but I just can't do it. I'll go into depth with those in a minute. We have some toilet paper, how glamorous, and some poles that are out all the time because again, like I said, the council don't do a full job properly. One day I hope to go without this uh, step stool, but for now we have it. And then in the cabinets, I tried to keep it very simple. I used up the mould cleaner, so I don't have that anymore and we just have the toilet gel. A couple of pads left over and then more toilet paper and wipes for my toddler which again, I won't have in the future, which will be nice. And then coming over here, we have his toilet seat with the bluey stickers, a toilet seat for going out and some stuff that I'm preparing to take with me tomorrow for swimming. Then I have my hair straighteners and my hair dryer and one of three towels that usually hang up there. Coming round, I have my shower curtain, the shower pole, the shower head and the thing it's attached to, my razor down here because the storage that's up here is useless and I don't know why they add it in because it absolutely sucks. So down here we have my shampoo and my conditioner. I use the shampoo as a shower gel for me and my toddler and I use the conditioner to do our hair and also the shampoo to do our hair. I have a full bath, which I really appreciate and new tiles that were put in. But like I said, the council don't do a very good job of doing a full job. So there's that, that I have to deal with next. So on here is some painting that desperately needs to be done. I have my body oil that I just replaced with the other oil and I don't think I'm gonna keep it. I think I'm gonna go back to a lotion. Then we have some sunscreen because it's summer here in the UK. If it's not summer, I won't have it, but it is summer, so we have it. Some deodorant our everyday toothpaste and toothbrushes. I can't wait for the day where we share the same toothpaste because it's less clutter and less things to buy. I don't have nail varnish or any of that stuff anymore. And I think I've got rid of something else that was like out with this lot um, because I don't need them anymore. And my life is so busy in other ways that I just don't want to spend time doing my nails and worrying about my nails. So we don't have that stuff anymore. I'd like to live with less than this, certainly because of that stuff in the corner, but also in this area as well. It'd be really nice to have less. I tried to live without shampoo, but it didn't work. I tried to live without conditioner, but it didn't work. So I can't do that. But this area, I'd like to have a little bit less in. And obviously the step stool and the toilet seats will go in time when he's out of the toddler stage. So yeah, um, that's it. I don't have a lot to show you because it's a small, small bathroom and the lighting's terrible in here and I don't have a lot of products because I like it that way.